Yeah, I would say speed is, is a big challenge because we, I, I don't think we have a shortage of ideas. I do think we have an inability to get those ideas from concept to um, market uh, in a timely ma manner. Uh, I think that's a challenge. And I do think sometimes uh, we don't get out of our own way <laughs> in respect to that. And again, from the environments that I've come, it's probably the opposite end of the scale, uh, whether it's the, the companies that I've been on the board of or the companies that I've worked with, where you can have innovation cycles that are weeks and months rather than years. And so to me, it, some things you have to take years to do, but you want those things to be few and far between, uh, and they're more iterative. Um, so deploying a lot more of the new ways of working, particularly around DevOps and agile type methodologies, uh, so that we can actually get things out fast and we can unlock a lot of the potential that our employees really do have. Just thinking about that, if you were to scroll forward, come back in five years' time at our 15th uh, anniversary, and think about what will innovation look like in a world in which we've done a lot of the, this core enabling of digital infrastructure and the network has moved to the next generation and IoT is really in full swing. What's innovation like then? I think I'll be being interviewed by a robot <laughs> and, and I'll be uh, actually doing that you know, via a hologram and not actually physically here, but that's okay. From my perspective, I do think this speed thing starts uh, to happen in the two-year time frame. I do think we have some foundational elements that really sort of have to be unlocked so that we can uh, do that. I do think there'll be a lot more collaboration between us and third parties, um, customers and partners included, to actually bring out uh, the next wave of, of products over that time frame as opposed to saying, ta-da, here it is, um, buy it. <laughs> It'll be, okay, well, this is uh, our idea around that. What do you think about it? How do we actually evolve that? And I think that really changes the way we work as an ecosystem within Australia. Mm. So, and I think that in itself gets over the scale issue because fundamentally we have the best technology in the world. You, we, can, we can have that. It, it's actually here and it will be uh, available to us as we move forward. Scaling it, I think, takes a, a slightly different business model, which is you know, this collaborative uh, approach between customers and partners and ourselves and universities and broader parts of the region as opposed to just uh, within the confines of Australia.